Hello, I am about to show you how to print your own sample labels at home. So, let me share my screen and get rid of that. And we are at the virtual office, vo.perfectlyposh.com. Click on Posh Comms. Think Posh Comms, Posh Communication, where you can find all the things Posh wants to tell us. And then within Posh Comms, click on the Asset Library, the library of all of your assets, <laughs> such as sample labels. And in the search box, I am going to type, I can't see what I'm typing because of this box. Okay, Sassiuma Sample. What the sample? Okay. That's the Uma sample. La, 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 la. There it is. This one here is more for the body wash. I made Sassy Uma body wash samples. If you haven't figured that out yet. So you could print this out. It doesn't really say what it is though. So there's two schools of thought. You could just save this and I'll show you how to actually like print it on stickers. Um, or you can get the picture of the entire product and put that on your sample sticker. But on this, it's barely, you can barely see what it does anyway. So what I might do is save this and then just type in the words body wash. That's what I'm gonna do. And I'm gonna show you how to do that. So I'm clicking on high resolution and it saved it to my computer. In the, it sets up where I, it goes to my download folder, but everybody's computer is different. Then I go over to avery.com. I have Avery labels and you can get generic labels that will tell you um, what Avery labels they coordinate to, but Avery is a major label brand and every one of their products has a number. And these are Avery 5410. You look up at my video, 5410, Avery 5410. It is one inch round circle labels and there are 12 labels on a sheet. This just looks like a piece of paper to you, but, oh, it is not. It is a sheet of round little stickers, okay? Um, other people print these on a one whole sheet that doesn't have circles on them because they have trouble lining them up. I don't have trouble lining them up. I get the ones that are already circle shaped. You can also buy sheets of paper that is one flat sticker paper and then you use a hole punch to cut, cut these out, but that is way too much extra work for my liking. And sometimes my labels don't line up perfectly, but it's still going to save me a lot of time. You can get these in like full size sheet. This is a different one, but like full sheets too. Uh, I just prefer 12 to a sheet because I usually just make like 12 or 24 of a sample at a time. I don't need 60 stickers. But if you're, if you're going to town, get the bigger sheets. Uh, just put in the coordinating label. So um, I clicked on projects. What I really meant to click on is templates though. So find the right template to print your Avery product. I told you my number was 5410. So that's the one that I want. I click on it. I click start designing. My computer goes so slow when I am recording these videos. So I'm sorry. It's a lot faster when I'm just me. So there's all kinds of like, stuff you can do and things that Avery puts here, but I just pick the blank one because I'm uploading my own image to put there. Something else I've done is I've just gone to this blank and just typed it before they had all the pretty pictures loaded in. Or if you just want to do like black and white and put words, if you want to just take this, um, side note so I can get rid of this box, edit all or edit one, you can make different labels one 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 at a time if you want but i'm making a whole sheet so i'm going to click edit all um 
you can go in and add a text box and just type Just type Sassy and assume a body wash if you want to. Um, or you can just write it on the sticker to make it really easily easy for you. But if you're watching this, you want to know how to print stuff. So you could do it like that. Um, I have done that before. And I've also um, made the print smaller and added my website on the bottom. So say my website would be at the bottom of the label, which is cool. Because then my info was on it. I'm just going to delete that. And I'm going to add the image. So I'm over here on the left and I'm clicking on image, add image, browse for file. And then it should be right here. Bam. Ta-da. Now that's tiny. So you just drag, click. Whoop, 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 whoop. They're really picky about you going in and out of the borders here. Just drag it through the borders. Voila, it is on there. So that is what one sticker will look like. But when you look over here, it shows you the whole sheet, preview and print. I say print it myself because I have the labels. And then I've got to put this piece of paper into my printer. Always makes you save it, which I do. And I will type Sassy Uma Body Wash. So I can just go into here when I need to make more and um, it'll be there already done for me. So I can just go in, open it up and print. It saves it to my Avery account. And that, this whole Avery thing, it's totally free. So I just, again, I can't see my controls at the top of my page. All right, print. Sorry, it's so slow. It's because I'm recording. Should probably delete some stuff off this. Make sure you're on the right printer. Okay, look at it, that. We don't want it to look like that. So I want mine to be in color. And then I'm going to change this to four by six because that's the size of the paper. And it's printing, we hope. There it goes. <laughs> Sorry if you're impatient. <laughs> I try to make these videos as fast as possible. If you have any questions about any of these steps, please ask. Um, I just want to show you this when it's done and stick one on to have this be complete. But um, please ask me any questions. And um, hopefully the video shows you step by step how simple and easy this is. All right. Yep. They're printed. They're centered. Lucky me. Ta-da! Easy as that. All right. Bye.